Hey guys, we got some news here. It came out a few days ago um, from Comic Book uh, Cast on YouTube here. Uh, so we're gonna take this with a grain of salt, just because with YouTube channels coming up with uh, with with news and stuff, it's not always accurate. Um, but uh, never seen them have any exclusive before. And yet uh, we'll see where things are gonna go with this. Since I've only been able to find anything about it is from Comic Book Cast. None of the other websites online have ever have even picked this up yet. So it could be really really early on, or who knows what this could be. But to take it as a huge grain of salt um, but let's just talk about it anyways because why not so um, it sounds like Marvel Studios is looking into absorb Marvel TV and I think that could be an interesting idea it could be really fun and it would be way awesome to have Kevin Feige in charge of the movies and the TV shows bringing it all up together so that there could be a lot easier from the crossover with Kevin Feige running both of them he'd really easily be able to keep track of everything and then be able to bring it and make it a lot easier to, to, to cross over now I don't think you're probably gonna have you know if you had Avengers Infinity War you bring all the TV guys you know the Defender and Age of Shield and the Runaways and Cloak and Dagger you got a movie with like two like 200 uh, like almost over a hundred almost 150 characters in there and there's no way you can keep them all in in there you can, there's no way you can uh run a movie i mean infinity war was fast paced on its own if they had just jumped out and thrown up infinity war before establishing any of the other stuff that would have been like so jam-packed to put in there and putting more characters into this movie movie would not have really worked so i think the idea is where the way things could go is maybe having you know a spider-man movie with with wilson fisk as the villain and daredevil joins him for that i think that could be an interesting idea to do that and it could be fun with kevin feige running it you could set it up on the season of daredevil you have a daredevil season where you know it ends with the cliffhanger being that oh my god he needs to you know with with a spider-man easter egg at the end and it's like He's gonna have to team up with Spider-Man, and that's when you will announce the movie at the end of the season. I think that could be an interesting idea, and having Kevin Feige in charge of both that with Jeff Loeb could be quite fun to see that, and it could be quite cool to see where things are gonna go. And I feel like Kevin Feige has a better, obviously has a lot more power to not uh, let some things like Iron Fist and um, and and uh, Inhumans happen. Uh, again, he would not let those things fly. So I think those things would be really cool to see where things are going to go with that and how things are going to turn out with this story. But for now, we're just going to have to cross our fingers and see what happens with this because uh, there's only one source talking about it for now. So let me know what you think, guys, about this in the comments below. Do you think it could be real? Do you think it's fake? Let me know what you think about this regarding this uh, tidbit from Comic Book Cast. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. I'm Captain America, here to talk to you about one of the most valuable traits a soldier or student can have. Subscribing. Sometimes subscribing. is the key to victory. Sometimes it leads to very little, and it seems like it's not worth it. And you wonder why you waited so long for something so disappointing. How many more of these? You're still here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, guys. Peace. It's over.